hello friends today we are going to study the new unit the frames and let us begin with the uh, lesson uh, the prose lesson the project tiger written by satyajit ray a memo his own experience uh in the film world as we can see in the in his profile here uh, he is a great indian writer he was uh, very much famous for his film pate panchali again the world of appu aparajito uh, and again uh charilada etc uh, his uh, a m- a most one of the most renowned of the films is uh, this patay panchali he was uh, inspired after uh, meeting with french filmmaker as it is written here in the profile uh, Jean Renoir the film uh, French filmmaker and after being Vittorio De Sica an Italian uh, neo realist film bicycle thieves bicycle thief an Italian neo realist film uh, by Vittorio De Sica after viewing uh, these two after viewing the after uh, meeting the uh, jean renoir the filmmaker and be, uh, viewing the bicycle thief uh, he got inspired and he stepped into the film world so let us uh, begin uh, without any introduction uh, i know we cannot uh, begin this lesson without a short introduction of, uh, about uh, hollywood you are very much familiar with uh, hollywood films when we watch tv you might have seen sometimes those great films uh, avengers you may be familiar with uh, that film avenger 1 and 2 uh, and different uh, series of that film again uh, the great uh, hollywood film avatar we are very much uh, we have heard a lot about all these films so uh, the writer tells us that no one can beat hollywood when it comes to making films with animals animals in them so no one can beat hollywood when it comes to making films with animals in them i remember films in my childhood and there were quite a few of them that had an alsatian called rin tin tin this dog's acting was more impressive than a human's later we got to see three or four other films with a coolie called with a coolie called lassie it seemed that the director could make lassie do just about anything these trained dogs were famous stars in their own rights and the money they earned was no less than what a real film star got their owners could easily make as much as 100000 rupees from just one film this mama project tiger begins with a reference to uh, the hollywood film he says that no one can uh, beat hollywood when it comes to the matter of making uh, films with animals in them i remember films in my childhood he uh, he tells us about uh, a film in, uh, which he had seen in his uh, while he was a boy and uh, he's telling us about an alsatian dog rin tin tin and what is the uh, peculiarity of this uh, dog this dog's acting was more impressive than humans 
more attractive than human the acting of this dog was very much attack attractive later we got to see four or other films with a collie called lassie uh, so uh, he tells us about uh, another dog named lassie uh, which belongs to uh, the breed of collie see we can see the uh, picture of such a breed here see any of the several breeds of dog with long hair see this uh, this kind of dogs so uh, that's it let's again come to the text so what's the name of that collie let's see and it seemed that director could make uh let me check the pronunciation of this uh, this name is it right yes lassi okay it's right lassi so as we have seen here so the dog lassi it seemed that director could make lassi do just about anything he could yeah, whatever he ask the dog lassi would do it appo lassi enna parayna ya naaya edanathil pettana koli enna enathil pettana koli enna enathil pettana naayada pratheeda ennu parayna ya director endu parayalum endu cheyyam aa koli aa naayada cheyyam and he says that uh, satyatre says that these trained dogs were famous stars in their own rights in their own way in their own uh, way uh, they were uh, famous stars famous film stars and they earned money and how much money did they earn etra paisa yana avare earn cheyathu no less than what a real film star got they earned as much money as a real film star appa avare enganeyana avare evaru film star etra paisa earn cheyunnundo athram thanne earn to what do i mean by earn malayalam what is the meaning of earn uh, yes to receive money as a payment appa sambadikkanu nammal malayalathil parayum so uh, they earn as much money as a real film star their owners could easily make as much as 100000 rupees from just one film 100000 rupees could the, could be made by the owners in owners from just one film uh, nowadays we may uh, it may be a, not much money when we say 100000 but during those days that is uh, about uh, 40 years back it is a uh, considerable amount it is a considerable amount it is uh, it is a good amount 100000 rupees nowadays it may be a not so okay uh, as i told you earlier in the beginning he refers to hollywood and mm, hollywood film making film making using animals and he tells us about rent and an alsatian an alsatian dog uh, let us look look at the picture of an alsatian dog how does it look like is there a picture of an alsatian dog not here okay yes it is here it is german shepherd cell see this is an alsatian dog uh, an alsatian dog see this is it no it is not a german shepherd it's a, okay an alsatian dog okay look here if uh, some kind of a fierce dog that's it Okay. 
an Alsatian dog. Let us check the dictionary. It's cobbled, colon cobbled. A large, usually fierce dog that is often used to guard buildings or by the police to help them find criminals. From criminal level, I put it again, maybe police my Alsatian again. Again, a fierce dog that is used to guard building. And let us look at the pronunciation, sir. Alsatian. Alsatian. So let's come back. Then he tells us about a collie named Lassie. And uh, he tells us about the feature, uh, about the uh, a notable thing uh, or thing that he noticed about uh, uh, Lassie. The, uh, and uh, he is telling us that Lassie will do whatever his director. Uh, whatever his owner asks him whatever his owner asks him he will do it so in the second paragraph he says I realize how reverently these animal actors were treated when I happened to see the shooting of a film 20 years ago in Disney studio in Hollywood see it is 25 years ago he saw a shooting in Disney studio and he died in the year 1992 and now uh, 20 years have passed after this or 19 years have passed after his death again uh, he had seen this uh, shooting about 20 years 25 years back oh sorry 20 years back in disney uh, studio so all together about 40 years or 50 years ago he had seen a shooting uh, he, has, he had seen the shooting of a film uh, in Disney studio in Hollywood and he realized he understood how respectfully these animal actors were treated there by animal actors in a Mrgangle Nadanmara Itrala Mrgangle Avaratra Bhumana Thode and a treaty in the Nana Epitome and Saraki the Hollywood studio Hollywood dinner Disney studio Ludo shooting and the period the main character in this film was a large dog I reached the studio to find that the shooting had not yet started. So, the main character of the uh, film is a large dog. And he re when he reached the uh, shooting site, when he reached the studio, the shooting had not started. They had not started the shooting. He reached there early. Uh, shooting what happened then? So he says that he reached the cameraman was getting the lights ready. It is customary for actors to be present when the lights are arranged. Or they have to show the cameraman how they will walk or where they will stand in a particular show. In the case of a very famous stars, in the case of very famous stars, this job is done by the stand-ins. A stand-in is usually a person who is physically similar to the real star. The stars themselves arrive only when the lights are ready and it is time to take a shot. So when he reached the studio, what was the cameraman doing? He was getting the camera ready. He was uh, getting uh, the lights ready. He was arranging the lights, light to laying and arranging. So it was, it is a usual practice for an actor to be present when the lights are arranged. So when the lights are arranged, what should the character do, main character do? He should be present. For they have to show the cameraman how they will walk or where they will stand in a particular show. Why should the actors be there when the cameraman's uh, arrange the lights they should show the cameraman how they will walk where they will stand in a particular scene so, 
കാരണം ആക്ടേഴ്സിന് ക്യാമറമാനെ അറിയിക്കണം എന്ത് അവരെങ്ങനെയാണ് നടക്കുന്നത് അവരെവിടെയാണ് നിൽക്കുന്നത് ഒരു നിശ്ചിത സീനിൽ സോ ആക്ടേഴ്സ് ഷുഡ് ബി ദ വയൽ ദ ക്യാമറമാൻ അറേഞ്ചസ് ദ ലൈറ്റ് ബട്ട് ഹിയർ ഇൻ ദിസ് കേസ് വട്ട് ഹാപ്പൻസ് ഇൻ ദ കേസ് ഓഫ് വെരി ഫേമസ് സ്റ്റാർസ് ദിസ് ജോബ് ഈസ് ഡൺ ബൈ ദ സ്റ്റാൻഡിൻസ് ആൻഡ് so uh, in the case of superstars or very familiar very famous actors the this job will be done by stand-ins we say dupe we say duplicate actors appo alle nammal endu parayum dupe galu nu parayum appo ee stand-ins nanu adinu mattoru baaki stand-ins aayirikku aa oru karyam cheynathu instead of main actors who will come in the case of very famous actors instead of them who will come stand-ins will come and സ്റ്റാൻഡിൻ പൊസിഷൻ അപ്പോൾ സ്റ്റാൻഡിൻസ് ആയിരിക്കും ഡ്യൂപ്പുകളായിരിക്കും വന്ന് നിൽക്കുന്നത് എ സ്റ്റാൻഡിൻ ഈസ് യൂഷ്വലി എ പേഴ്സൺ ഹു ഈസ് ഫിസിക്കലി സിമിലർ ടു ദ റിയൽ സ്റ്റാർസ് സോ വട്ട് ഈസ് എ സ്റ്റാൻഡിൻ ഹു ഈസ് എ സ്റ്റാൻഡിൻ എ പേഴ്സൺ ഹു ഈസ് ഫിസിക്കലി സിമിലർ ടു ദ റിയൽ സ്റ്റാർ സോ ഹു ഈസ് എ സ്റ്റാൻഡിൻ ഈസ് സ്റ്റാൻഡിൻ ഇസ് എ പേഴ്സൺ ഹു ഈസ് ഫിസിക്കലി സിമിലർ ബോത്ത് ഓഫ് ദം ലുക്സ് like one look the same appa standings nu parney nyala a real star inde ekke ore pole irikkuna aalkar aayirikkum standings nu the stars themselves will themselves arrive only when the lights are ready and it is time to take a shot so when will the real stars arrive only when it is time to take a shot when the lights are ready appa real stars appadiyana varunathu only when the lights are ready or when it is time to take a shot for real stars varunathu light gal ella ready aayi kaniyumbile shot edukkana shooting thodangana samayam aagumbile appo what happened here in disney studio i noticed that a few actors were moving about in the set and on one side standing quietly was the protagonist the same large dog so when i reached disney studio i notice viewing uh, few actors moving in the set and who is standing on one side standing quietly was the hero of the uh, film and who is the who was the hero of the film who was the protagonist the same large dog so Uh, in the beginning of the paragraph in the beginning of paragraph number 2 the writer uh, satyadre uh, tells us about a large dog tells us about a large dog so this same large dog is uh, standing quietly on one side the cameraman shouted to everyone to take their position but the dog did not move it remained where it was this is this confused me this puzzled me could it be that it was not required in the next show so i was confused i was surprised i was confused nan aashay kulapathilai a question uh, rose in my mind was the dog not necessary in the next scene appam ee dog vendayo adutha scene like uh, could it be that it was not required in the next scene why why did he think like that when the cameraman asked everybody to get ready to uh, everybody to take their position dog did not move it remained in the same position appa ella virudumayitte cameraman paranju take your position ningale avaravarude position la nikke ready aayikku ennu paranju patti ma valli patti mathram അനങ്ങുന്നില്ല അപ്പം സത്യത്രയ്ക്ക് തോന്നി ഇവനെ ആ ഒരു സീനിൽ വേണ്ടായോ ഓക്കെ ഇൻ ദ ഫോർത്ത് പാരഗ്രാഫ് ഹി ടെൽസ് ഇസ് ദാറ്റ് ബിഫോർ ഐ കുഡ് ആ സമൺ എ സ്ട്രേഞ്ച് തിങ് ഹാപ്പൻ ഫ്രം നോ വെയർ അപ്പിയർഡ് എ ലിറ്റിൽ ഡാഫ് ഫോളോഡ് ബൈ അനദർ മാൻ ക്യാരിങ് എ ഹെയറി ഡോക്ക് സ്കിൻ ദെൻ ടു മൈ പെർഫെക്റ്റ് അമേസ്മെന്റ് the dog went down on all the fours on a chalk mark on the floor just like an animal 
and the dog skin was draped over him then he crawled then he crawled from one mark to another and the cameraman got busy with the lights it finally dawned upon me that this dog was paid to be the dog stand in see the picture the real dog was standing here the main character and this is the uh, stand in a man in disguise in the uh, uh, in the guise of a dog so uh, a man wearing dog skin so so uh, a, a question came to my mind was this dog not nursery in the next scene suddenly what happened before i could ask anyone a strange thing happened uh, i was about to ask somebody but uh, i i don't have to i didn't have to why some strange thing something strange happened then from nowhere a little dwarf appeared there dwarf what do you mean by dwarf kulla le a small a person uh, smaller than an ordinary man so is a uh, dwarf appeared from somewhere from nowhere followed by another man what was he carrying a hairy dog skin so a dwarf came to the spot then uh, he was uh, a, another man carrying a hair and uh, carrying a dog skin came after him apo oru pattiyada thoral oru skin ulla oru kuppayam konde mattoru manushinodu vannu then to my surprise then to my perfect amazement i was fully surprised I was totally surprised perfect amazement i was totally surprised the dwarf went down on all the fours on his chalk mark on the floor like an animal so Ma- the the floor was marked and what did the man wearing the dog skin do he went down on all the four mark he went down on all the fours on the chalk mark on the floor just like an animal he went down he pretended to be a dog on its four lex he bent down like a dog he stood like a dog on its four legs and what is he wearing a dog skin was draped over him his body was loosely covered with a dog skin his body was loosely covered with a dog skin and he was standing there he was standing there and i understood then he crawled then he crawled then he crawled what, what did he do he crawled from one mark to another then he started moving uh, from one point to another the cameraman got busy with the lights i fo- it finally dawned upon me i finally understood that this dark was paid to be the dog stand in so uh, after bending down on its four uh, uh, after uh, the man wearing the dog skin bent down like a dog on its four legs he started moving like a dog from one position to another and what is the cameraman doing he was arranging the lights he was uh, busy with the camera busy with the lights and i finally understood that this man this dar is the stand in of the main character the last dog pa endha sambhavichu ivide അപ്പം ഞാൻ എന്തെങ്കിലും ചോദിക്കുന്നതിന് മുമ്പ് പെട്ടെന്ന് ഒരു കുള്ളനായൊരു മനുഷ്യൻ അവിടേക്ക് വന്നു അയാളുടെ പുറയെ മറ്റൊരു മനുഷ്യനുണ്ടായിരുന്നു അയാളുടെ കയ്യിൽ
നായിൻ്റെ ഈ നായ്ക്കളുടെ ഒരു ഒത്തിരി രോമമുള്ള ഒരു നായിൻ്റെ നായ്ക്കളുടെ തോല് എന്നിട്ട് എന്നെ അത്ഭുതപ്പെടുത്തിക്കൊണ്ട് ആ കുള്ളനായ മനുഷ്യൻ എന്താ ചെയ്തത് അവിടെ നിലത്ത് നാല് മാർക്കുകൾ വരച്ചിട്ടുണ്ടായിരുന്നു ആ മാർക്കിലോട്ട് കുനിഞ്ഞങ്ങ് നിന്ന് ഒരു മൃഗത്തെ പോലെ അയാളുടെ ശരീരത്തിന് ചുറ്റും എന്തു എന്ത് പൊതച്ചു ആ നായ്ത്തോല് പൊതച്ചു ആ മനുഷ്യൻ എന്ത് ചെയ്യാൻ തുടങ്ങി ഇഴയാൻ തുടങ്ങി ഒരു മാർക്കിൽ നിന്ന് മറ്റൊരു മാർക്കിലേക്ക് ആ സമയമെല്ലാം ക്യാമറ മാൻ എന്ത് ചെയ്യായിരുന്നു ലൈറ്റുമായിട്ട് ക്രമ ഭയങ്കര തിരക്കിലായിരുന്നു ലൈറ്റ് അറേഞ്ച് ചെയ്യുന്ന തിരക്കിലായിരുന്നു ആൻഡ് ഡോണ്ട് അപ്പ് ഓൺ മീ ഐ അണ്ടർസ്റ്റാൻഡ് ഫൈനലി ദാറ്റ് ദ ഡാർഫ് ഈസ് ദ സ്റ്റാൻഡിൻ ഡാർഫ് ഈസ് വാസ് ടു വാസ് പെയ്ഡ് വാസ് ഗിവൺ പേയ്മെൻറ്റ് ഡാർഫിനാണ് പേയ്മെൻറ്റ് നൽകിയിരിക്കുകയാണ് ടു പ്രിട്ടേൺ ലൈക്ക് എ സ്റ്റാൻഡിൻ ടു ബി ദ സ്റ്റാൻഡിൻ ടു ഇനാക്ട് ദ റോൾ ഓഫ് എ ഡ്യൂ അപ്പം ഒരു ഡ്യൂപ്പിൻ്റെ റോൾ ഇനാക്ട് ചെയ്യാൻ വേണ്ടി ആ ഡാർഫിന് പേ ചെയ്തിരിക്കുകയാണെന്ന് എനിക്ക് മനസ്സിലായില്ലെങ്കിൽ ആ ഒരു മെയിൻ ക്യാരക്ടറായിട്ടുള്ള ആ ഡോഗിന് പകരം ഡ്യൂപ്പായിട്ടാണ് ആര് ആ മനുഷ്യൻ സി സി ദ ഐറണി ഹിയർ സി ദ ഐറണി എ മാൻ is enacting as a stand in as a due for a dog not a dog is acting the role of a man he is here a man is act, in acting he is acting like a dog every animal every animal in human sorry in hollywood film is well trained it is not difficult to train a horse or a dog but have you ever but have we ever head of trained travels not just one or two but nearly 100 of them even when this was made possible in hollywood when the creator of some of the best suspense film in the history of cinema alfred hitchcock decided to make a film name film called bird film called bird In the story birds from all over the world start attacking humans Hitchcock needed a variety of birds but what was required in large number was raven notices were placed in the press all over the united states asking people to contact the filmmaker if they knew how to get hold of trained raven so he is telling us another example he is in his mama is uh, satyatra is telling us another example from hollywood so he says that every animal in hollywood is well trained hollywood le ella film il ulla abhinayikkuna mrugangal engena nalla parichayam lebichavaraana it is not difficult to train a horse or a dog but to get a trained raven what i mean by raven malankaka le malankaka have you ever heard of a trained raven not just one or two hundreds of them appa malankaka or onno rendu alla pinne enganeyana malankaka ennu parayumbo valiya kaakala appa onno rendu alla pinne enganeyana 100 kanakkana this was made possible in hollywood in the film birds directed by the great alfred hitchcock the producer and director alfred hitchcock alfred hitchcock in the cinema il adum sadhyamayi even this was made possible in hollywood when the creator of some of the best suspense film in the history of cinema alfred hitchcock decided to make a film called bird so he is asking he is uh, trying to draw our attention to the fact that nothing is impossible in hollywood to get a to get a trained ravens not one or two hundreds of them 
and to uh, make them act in a film that is made possible in hollywood with the creation of the film birds by alfred hitchcock and what is the story about birds from all over the world start attacking humans hitchcock needed a variety of birds but what was required in large number was a raven notices were placed in presses in the press all over the united states so uh, the story was about uh, birds attacking humans so hitchcock needed a different kind of birds and what was required in large number was ravens so uh, different kinds of bird at uh was attacking human being humans and uh, he wanted different kind of uh, different kinds of bird what was mostly required was ravens ravens were required in large number and notice were uh, placed on all over america and the notice asked them to contact if they knew about any such trained ravens if they knew how to get hold of how to catch such trained how to get such trained ravens if they anybody any of the person know the contact number uh, please contact the filmmaker apa ഹോളിവുഡിൽ ട്രെയിൻ അല്ലെ ആനിമൽസ് എങ്ങനെയാണ് വളരെ പരിശീലനം ലഭിച്ചവരാണ് പക്ഷേ പരിശീലിപ്പിക്കുക എന്ന് പറഞ്ഞാൽ ഈ നായ്ക്കളെയോ അല്ലെങ്കിൽ കുതിരയോ പരിശീലിപ്പിക്കുക എന്ന് പറഞ്ഞാൽ വലിയ പാടൊന്നുമില്ല പക്ഷേ മലം കാക്കകളെ പരിശീ പരിശീലനം ലഭിച്ച മലം കാക്കുകൾ എന്ന് പറഞ്ഞു കഴിഞ്ഞാൽ അത് ഒരിച്ചിരി പ്രയാസമാണ് ഒന്നോ രണ്ടോ അല്ല പിന്നെ എങ്ങനെയാണ് നൂറ് കണക്കിന് ഇതും എവിടെ സാധ്യമായി ആൽഫർട്ട് ഹിസ്കോക്കിൻ്റെ പേഡ് എന്ന സിനിമയിൽ അപ്പം ലോകത്തെ പക്ഷികൾ ആക്രമിക്കുകയാണ് മനുഷ്യരെ പക്ഷികൾ ആക്രമിക്കുകയാണ് എല്ലായിടത്തും നിന്നും ലോകം മുഴുവനും മനുഷ്യരെ പക്ഷികൾ ആക്രമിക്കുകയാണ് അപ്പോൾ ഇഷ്ടംപോലെ പക്ഷികളെ വേണം പലതരത്തിലുള്ള പക്ഷികളെ പക്ഷേ പ്രധാനമായിട്ടും എന്തിനെയാണ് വേണ്ടത് മലം കാക്കകളെ അപ്പോൾ നോട്ടീസ് എല്ലായിടത്തും പതിപ്പിച്ചു ആർക്കെങ്കിലും ഈ ഇതിനെക്കുറിച്ച് അറിയാവുന്നവരുണ്ടെന്നുണ്ടെങ്കിൽ ആരെ കോൺടാക്ട് ചെയ്യണം ഫിലിം മേക്കേഴ്സിനെ കോൺടാക്ട് ചെയ്യണം someone replied within a few days he was asked to bring his birds and he arrived with almost a hundred trained ravens admittedly their training had not gone very bad that is to say they could not do anything that might be seen an extraordinary but if as many as 50 ravens a hold to perch quietly in a row on a specified spot if they obey this command instantly isn't that pretty impressive <coughs> so to that notice a uh, notice and uh, notices were placed uh, all over america and after a few days somebody replied and he, the filmmakers they asked him to bring their birds he arrived with a hundred trained ravens he arrived there according to the request with a hundred trained ravens 100 kanakina malanga kalayumayitt vannu so it seems admittedly we should admit that the training that were undergone by the uh, ravens had not gone bad we cannot say the training was not uh, fruitful the training was very good or uh, very much uh, what shall i say the training was very much effective why why did the writer say like that because if anybody asks them to do something that is extraordinary 
they can't do it if anybody asks uh, the ravens to uh, pick up a huge stone they can't they couldn't do it but the writer satyajitra is asking if the trainer asks 50 of the birds to perch in a row on a specified spot if 50 of the ravens are asked to sit in a row in a specified spot if they obey that command instantly if they if the ravens obey it instantly we should admit that it is extraordinary it is impressive so the trainer if the trainer asks the 50 of the ravens to uh, sit on a, a particular spot in a uh, in a particular uh, pattern if they obey it isn't it impressive isn't it extraordinary appa aaro oralu marubadi paranju appa ayalude kelikalumayittu varan paranju 100 100 kelikalayum konde 100 malangakkalayum konde ayalathi appa namakku angiyiriche varathullu training nalla effective aayittulla training aayirund endu undu അവരോട് എന്തെങ്കിലും എക്സ്ട്രാ ഓണറി ആയിട്ട് ചെയ്യാൻ പറഞ്ഞു കഴിഞ്ഞാൽ ചിലപ്പോൾ അവർ ചെയ്തില്ലെന്ന് വരും പക്ഷേ അൻപത് ക മലങ്കാക്കളോട് പറയുക നിങ്ങൾ ഒരേ നിരയിൽ ഒരു നിശ്ചിത സ്ഥലത്ത് പോയി ഇരിക്കാൻ പറഞ്ഞാൽ അവരതനുസരിച്ച് അതേപോലെ ചെയ്യുമെങ്കിൽ അവരപ്പം തന്നെ അത് ചെയ്യുമെങ്കിൽ അത് അത്ഭുതകരമല്ലേ അത് ആകർഷകം അല്ലേ പ്രറ്റീം പ്രസീവ് തികച്ചും ആകർഷകം അല്ലേ so that's all about today's class shall wind up let me ask you certain questions before i wind up this Uh, let me uh, uh, look at the meaning here quiet completely purnamai impressive attractive aagrashikuna call any of the several breed of dog with long hair neenda romangalulla oru taram naaye neenda romangalu ulla നീണ്ട രോമങ്ങളുള്ള ഒരു തരം നായ് ഓൺ റൈറ്റ് വൺ സോൺ എബിലിറ്റി സ്വന്തം കഴിവിനാൽ റവറൺലി റെസ്പെക്ട്ഫുള്ളി ബഹുമാനപൂർവ്വം കസ്റ്റമർ ഈ പരമ്പരാഗതമായ പ്രോട്ടഗണിസ്റ്റ് നായകൻ ബസ്സിൽ കുഴപ്പിക്കുന്ന പെർഫെക്റ്റ് മൈസ്മെൻറ്റ് കംപ്ലീറ്റ് മൈസ്മെൻറ്റ് അത്ഭുതപ്പെടുത്തുന്ന ഡാർഫ് കുള്ളൻ എ പേഴ്സൺ ഹു ഈസ് മച്ച് സ്മോളർ ദാൻ യൂഷ്വൽ സൈസ് ട്രേപ്പ് ടു കവർ ലൂസ്ലി വിത്ത് ക്ലോസ് അയഞ്ഞ രീതി പുതിയത ക്രോൺ to move along on hands and knees or with your body stretched out along a surface idega dawn to become known ariyapaduga there is another meaning for dawn kulari early morning again raven one of the largest bird in the crow family malangaka first to sit on or near the edge of any something marichile irikya perch perch on a branch is say like admittedly must be admitted and he is here instantly but on the banish to send someone away especially from their country in order to the obvious easy to understand victim maya mama writing based on one's own personal experience or knowledge this project tiger is a mama or macro okay let me
write certain questions here. One. Why? Okay, another question. What is the stand in? Then one last question. So five questions here. Try to find out the answer of these questions. Why did Ray say that the training undergone by the Ravens had not gone very bad? What is the stand-in? What was customary for the actors when the cameraman was getting the lights ready? Name the two dogs which he recollects in the beginning of the lesson before i could ask someone a strange thing happened what is it so these are the five questions 
find out the answer from the text we have completed the first six paragraph of the lesson and how many uh, paragraphs remaining Fourteen paragraphs, no. Six, okay, eighteen paragraph. So uh, by uh, by the next period, we will be completing the remaining portion itself. Okay, thank you all. Go through the lesson, find out if there is any. portion that is difficult for you to understand if you find any please ask me don't be ashamed to ask me your doubts thank you